Hello guys, welcome to my channel, The Placement Prep. Today I'll be sharing my Netcracker interview experience for the role of junior software engineer, 8 lakh per annum. Netcracker has three rounds, aptitude and coding test, followed by technical interview and HI interview. Aptitude and coding test will be together. First, you'll have aptitude test and then uh, after finishing that, you'll have to do the coding question. So the quants was of medium level and the questions were asked from HCF and LCM, speed, time and distance and work and time, averages, percentages, profit and loss, etc. Logical reasoning was of easy to medium level and the questions were asked from the number series, the word logic, logical sequence of words, then analogy and uh, classification pattern, the blood relations, direction sense and seating arrangements. English was of easy and the basic grammar was asked. And for coding, coding questions, there were two questions. One was easy and one was of medium level. And the questions for me, one was asked from arrays and another one was asked from strings. Strings was uh, easy and arrays took a little bit time for me. And after finishing this uh, aptitude and the coding test, if you clear the round, you will be uh, asked to join for an technical interview. Technical interview was for about one hour and there was one panel member. Whole technical interview was based on my resume. And other than resume, they asked me about uh, this OOPS, DSA, SQL questions and my uh, puzzles. They asked me puzzles. So the first question which they asked me in the technical interview was tell me about yourself. And she asked me about my projects. And uh, since I had done some web development projects, she asked me questions on that. And she asked me to design a login page and to share my screen and show the code. Uh, then SQL queries were asked. Three queries were asked. One was of basic SQL query and two were using joins. And although languages which I which I had mentioned in my resume were asked. So I had mentioned Python and uh, I had done, done uh, machine learning projects. So, so she asked me questions on Python and the uh, machine learning questions. And uh, she asked me about pointers, searching and sorting algorithms, oops concepts and some basic questions on programming. Coming to DSA, she asked me questions from arrays, linked list, uh, binary search tree and graphs. After that, uh, she asked me two puzzles to solve and to um, and for the reference, I refer to Code Studio. So Code Studio, it's a uh, website from Coding Ninjas. So this has um, guided paths for each of the languages like HTML, for uh, C++, for DSA and even for puzzles. And one of the puzzle which she asked, uh, I had read in the code studio itself. So it's the best platform according to me to uh, do your quick revision or to study. And for SQL queries, uh, Code Academia is the best uh, platform to learn SQL queries. I'll mention the link in the description for both of these platforms. After clearing the technical interview, there was an HR interview. HR interview was for about 30 minutes and uh, um, tell me about yourself which is not mentioned in your resume was my first question and then he asked me about my weaknesses, my strengths, what difficulties did I face and how did I overcome it and he asked me the basic uh, scenario questions, basic HR questions and he discussed about the company and the bond and all those. So this was my Netcracker interview experience. If you have any doubt in the process, please mention in the comment section. I'll be happy to answer those. And uh, if you feel that this video is helpful for you, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.